I am J-Lo, super fan of J-Lo, so, and I kidnapped Miss Rainbow Days for the week. I'm going to be making super awesome stuff until next Saturday, so when you see me in our videos, they're my videos, because this is my channel, or release her in a week. I am super creative, so today I'm going to be showing you how to make my glasses. I can't see without them, so it's going to be hard, but I'm going to try to be Oh my gosh, these are real 3D glasses that you're going to get from your local movie theater. Mm. Easy spray, pop out the lenses, boom, boom, and then you have basically just like a plain black thing with 3D on the side. Super easy, you can't even tell it says 3D on the side because what you're going to do is you're going to take a Sharpie marker and cover that up on um, the sides. And then you're going to take a white Sharpie and put it right here and here, the white Sharpie paint preferably, and you'll have these glasses. Super fantabuloso. Now I'm going to show you how to make pumpkin because I'm super creative. Two pieces of orange foam, one piece of green foam, scissors. A circular stencilish thing, and a small circular stencilish thing. This is my deodorant and my odor eliminating gel, which I put flowers in. I think it's really better because I'm super fan to be also. So you're gonna take your orange pieces, take one of them, put your circular template on. By the way, you will need a pencil. I don't know where a pencil is. I'm gosh, I don't have a pencil on. So you can uh, just take this Sharpie uh, accent highlighter that's in orange. I don't it works. And I put that there on that, and I'm going to show you this. You're going to put your circle template on there, and you're just going to trace it all the way. Around. I don't know if you can see this. Just tracing it around. With this sharpie marker, you have to be super careful with it, so that's why I'm being like super careful. That's what it's going to look like. I'm going to take your small one and just make little bumps on it like this. And you make two of those. I think this is like about right. You should be down a little. So let me like that, and like that. It doesn't look like a pumpkin, so uh, basically you just want that main central. I don't know why I did the second one. Um, I'm experimenting here. I have made that before. You're going to take yours and just cut out the basic shape of a pumpkin. And it's pretty easy to do. I mean, it's just a pumpkin. You're going to want to make three humps probably because something's. I only have around three humps. I mean, I don't know. Just make whatever you want to make. And um, if you end up liking it, then that's great for you. This is my pumpkin. Don't really look like pumpkin, but it's all right. You're going to take your piece and put it on another piece of tape of the foam cardboard, and you're going to basically cut that out on that. Just foam is super easy to cut and that's why I chose it and um this is a cute fall craft for like Thanksgiving I know I use this with my mom all the time and stuff and um one should be a little bit longer than the other one I should have done thinking before I did this I'm dumb but it's okay most pictures of pumpkins don't really have but, like three little humps but I like it so one's slightly bigger than the other, as you can tell, I'm going to put this right, and then you're going to cut two holes on the middle of 
this one. You should the top, top, and then the second one you should cut the bottom like this. So then you stick them on top of each other. They make one pumpkin, a three-dimensional pumpkin that just doesn't sit right. So you're gonna have to cut this one probably farther up and just stick do that on there, and boom, you have a three-dimensional pumpkin. Now from here, this is where the hard part is. It is making other stuff to go on top of the pumpkin. The pumpkin is a little awkward. It's just a little bit of scary. It's cute. It should be worky like daddy. It's gonna sit a little odd sometimes, but it's, that's what I think is kind of cute about it is that it does sit a little odd. Um, you might want to cut the like split bigger and stuff. I did a little cut it like off, so that's why you don't want to cut it off at all. You have it like this. Just put that on there, and then so yeah, so you're gonna take this and you're gonna make. A little long, actually, kind of longish strips. I just gonna cut those out. This is about as long as you want it, and so you're gonna put it right up to the next little spot on there and cut it because that is, that is what you do. And, um, I wish I could fast forward this for you because this is just boring, but um, one, again, you're going to cut on the bottom, try to do it about evenly, and then one, you're going to cut, um, cut on both sides for this one, just like that, so that you can turn it this way, and just go like this, see? I need to cut this one longer. Up to almost the very top, and then you're just going to cut this one the same length. Put them against each other. So you can cut them. I'm sorry, this is really long. I, sh I should have. Ugh. I don't even know what I'm doing. It's okay, it's okay. There we go. So then you're just going to turn them like this and do it like this. Now, why would I do it like this? This is weird. Because, one end, you're just going to attach the pumpkin and like this. You're going to... I messed up. I had it so perfect and pretty last time, and now it's just so weird and stuff. Okay. I don't know how I messed up so bad. On it. You're going to cut those strips. And you're just going to put all that together, turn this one to the side, and just attach it like this, so that it's kind of attached on all ends. I am, then you're going to take these little emsies, you're going to cut them off. It will kind of go like this sometimes, but you have to keep it like this. Remember that they're two separate ones, so just cut it so it's supposed to be. And there you go. Twada! Look at your pumpkin. What, what? And I keep mine other one, which is way better on the kitchen table. So I'll keep this one right here on my desk. It's ugly and fat and stupid. You see it? There's my ugly fat and stupid pumpkin. I'm going to my desk. Peace out, Jello.